Welcome back to our channel guys. Today I have for you a fridge organization video and I'm super excited about it because I want to start doing more of these on my channel, just more organization videos, more home and just like what I do on a typical basis behind the scenes. So this fridge needed a deep clean and that is exactly what it got. I had to go in, it was like food waste, all kind of stuff, leftovers, stuff still marinating it's just a lot so i just want to go here and show you guys my process and i'm taking all the things out and getting it all cleaned that yellow stain you see that's liquid that got caught in between there so i got all of that cleaned up as well So now that it's clean, I got into every nook, every cranny, and I'm so happy and so pleased with a fresh fridge. I'm going to start putting everything into the organizers that I got from Burlington. These were very affordable. I believe the price ranges were from $3.99 to $5.99. And yes, so since we're out for the summer, I'm a teacher if you didn't know, we're out for the summer and I'm going to make my life a little easier as well as the kids by putting their snacks inside of these bins and organize them. So I gave them a quick clean and I'm going to sort all their snacks inside. I just went to Aldi and, and I got some groceries so I'm gonna do like a little Aldi haul for you guys and then I'm gonna show you guys some more containers that I bought and I'm gonna put everything back in the refrigerator because I did have I, I had to leave so I put most of the things back in there so they don't spoil but I want to show you guys all the things we got so this is a lot of summer food for the kids like not summer food but you guys you know what I'm saying like snacks and lunch meat and stuff like that that's quick and easy um, and then I got a few things for the meal plan this week and i'm going to show you guys um it's wednesday so i'm going to show you guys today tomorrow and friday's meal plan and uh yeah so let me show you guys the haul all right so this is an overview of what i just picked up from aldi and just really quick got some waffles um some italian dressing we're going to be making some spaghetti this week so that's that or actually today um some vanilla pudding cups as well as chocolate got these juicy burst black forest brand these are really good but they only come with so many in the pack so yeah i got some noodles because you guys know these kids eat all day long if you let them hold on oh i didn't mean to get the cup i meant to get the uh that's why they were three dollars okay i was i was meaning to get the individual bags but okay we'll do with that um i got some applesauce the strawberry kind i got these mandarin oranges this is for me i love the dice gel peaches it's really good i got some bread because we're going to be making sandwiches i'm not going to be cooking breakfast lunch and dinner so i got some bread for some sandwiches some spaghetti uh, noodles some sauce for our spaghetti i got these for the baby um these are really good he likes these types of things he's going into more like he eats all types of food guys he loves his baby food still so like the puree stuff but he eats table food as well he's about to be 11 months so i got some vinegar texas toast for tonight i got these cherry tomatoes and cucumbers for a salad this week and do a cucumber and tomato salad got some cheese um strawberries grapes and let's go back over here i got some pizza water the small things of water i got some capri suns and i got some yogurt for the girls i love the little smoothie yogurts um right here i'm just right do this right here i got some this so this is the first i'm going to try this out these are turkey sausage snack sticks and these are for me well these are for the girls too whoever wants to eat them but um i just wanted to try them out got that got some turkey meat ground beef for spaghetti and some chicken nuggets and i got some salmon for this week later on this week just a small thing of it it's just because it's just 
us and you know the, the girls like salmon but they don't eat too much of it so i got these 10 piece storage containers these are i think they're glass i gotta see they look like they're glass but even if they're not they're see-through the whole way and so that way um i can know what's inside of it because with the tupperware lids like you don't know until you open it i don't know like you can't see it but with these you can and i'm going to be using these for leftovers as well as um fruit and vegetables so i can get rid of this nightmare so i can get rid of this nightmare up there okay the baby's crying but i just want to give you guys an overview of what's happening i'm gonna put all this back into the fridge and put it up and then i'm gonna show you guys what the refrigerator is looking like after i tend to the baby <laughs> So I've been doing this for a while. I use the vinegar and I just give my fruit a little bath and it gets all the dirt and the debris off the fruit and it makes it accessible for the kids to just grab and go since it's already washed and clean. I'm using the bin that I got from Aldi and I lined it with paper towel to keep the moisture down. So if your kids are like my kids, it's hit and miss with the produce. Like if you buy too much, they don't eat it. If you buy too little, they eat it all up and then they need more. So what I've done, I just buy the same amount. I buy one bag of grapes and a bag of two bags of strawberries and whatever they don't eat, I'm just going to be making desserts with it. So for the strawberries this time around, they didn't want a lot of strawberries. So. I made a strawberry shortcake and I do have a little short talking about or showing you guys how to make that and it's so good. I also made a second batch because we ate it all so fast. So that's one way to keep your fruit um, from like getting old and stuff is to use it in a dessert. And you can also make candy grapes or like frozen grapes and they're so good. So I got these fridge bin liners from Marshall, so for about $3.99, very affordable and it's going to keep the moisture in the drippings and all of the waste and all that kind of stuff if you have any spills down to a minimum, especially with small kids, it's just bound to happen. Also, this is my favorite part and that is putting everything back in order. I did save some room at the top, you're going to notice that because we eat leftovers in this house. We love hibachi leftovers, especially if we have those. But also, I batch cook. So when I make spaghetti or anything like that, I make double so that way we can have it for the next day. And that's going to be the space for that. I do believe in functionality over presentation. So um, I, although I wanted this to be so cute and all that, you know, I wanted it to be cute. I didn't put any labels or anything on it because the bins are going to be interchangeable. It's going to be different snacks and different bins at different times. So that's that. So the front of our stove, like the face of it, it fell off. So it still works. The oven still works, but um, we have to like hold on it with screws and all that. They're going to replace the whole stove in a week or so. So I just want to let you guys know about that. But yeah, it's been fun. <laughs> So now we are finished guys. I love how it turned out. Everything is in a place. Everything is organized. You can see everything from the first view. Like you open the door, you can see all the things that you have. You don't have to look behind anything, which is great. The kids can find their snacks easily. I can find what I need easily. Stick around for the ending so I can show you guys my meal plan for the week. Also, if you like this type of content, please stick around for more. 
um, subscribe to our channel like this video comment below and yeah let me know what you want to see I can try to show you guys different parts of our life some more vlogs whatever um, you guys want to see just let me know and yeah until next time don't forget to like comment and subscribe bye guys